I was sitting on the steps of City Hall after work on Monday, thinking about what I was going to ask people for this week's video blog. The day was hot, even the dogs were taking refuge in the shade. And as I sat on the steps, I closed my eyes, I thought about an ice cream cone I had seen on the side of an awning. Mmm, ice cream. I thought about how good that would taste in my mouth, cold and sweet. Then all of a sudden, I knew what I wanted to ask for this week's video blog. Do you like ice cream, Chris? Ice cream? I do like ice cream. Who doesn't like ice cream, right? Everyone likes ice cream. Chris, my question for you this week is, if you had to choose a flavor of ice cream to describe your personality, what flavor of ice cream would you be? Well, that's a tough question. Um... In Europe, we have a flavor called stracciatella. It's like vanilla with little chocolate sparkles. And I think it's like me, because I'm like plain, but with a little bit of a sparkle in it. Sesame seed yogurt ice cream with honey. It tastes a lot like the Israeli halva. <laughs> I have no idea. Mint chip. Mint chip? Yeah. Can you give me an explanation? No. Do you, do you just love mint chip? I do. It's kind of exotic, but it uses like really basic ingredients. Peppermint stick. You feel like occasionally you're a little crunchy? Yeah, or crunchy being mean to certain people. Yeah, sometimes I'm not nice. Do you like ice cream, Jim? Uh, I like it, but I don't eat it. Why don't you eat it? Because fat's not good for you. I agree with you. Unfortunately, I can't seem to help myself. If you had to choose a flavor of ice cream to describe your personality, what flavor of ice cream would you be? Not vanilla, that's for sure. Um, tutti Frutti. What about you? Have you answered the question? Oh, it's a difficult question. I've tried to answer it. Um, I keep coming up with like chocolate peanut butter. Yeah, that's a good one too, the salty and sweet combination. I like the saltiness yeah. and the sweetness. Some people are vanilla, others are more of a rocky road. I stood there on the street near Harold's, filming some bears enjoying what looked to be like a delicious bowl of fake ice cream, when all of a sudden a perfect couple came out. She asked me if I would like her to take a giant bite of his ice cream. I see that you're eating ice cream. That's one of my favorite things in life. What flavor did you get today? This is a chip chunk. It's banana with walnuts and chocolate. I'd have to go with like a passion fruit because I'm a little zippy but a little sweet and well, it might be a little hard at first to get used to it, everybody likes me in the end. <laughs> so there you have it, folks. This week's question is in the bag. We've gotten some interesting answers. Stay tuned to next week. Uh, I'm sure we'll have another interesting question for you to uh, listen to. Thanks for watching. It's nature's promise to wake up with the sun. So Sometimes I can be a little tart, tangy. I get a little swirly in my head. Can't always sort out my thoughts. You know, I have a lot of different sides to me. A lot of different interests, from like science to arts. Mario Lopez. And Come on, you're Mario Lopez? A verbal kind of guy, so tutti frutti rolls right off your tongue. Because she loves banana and chocolate and walnuts. What's your name? I'm Ben. Hi, Ben. Hi, nice to meet you. Don't shake my hand. I've been eating ice cream that's... Oh, then it's okay. <laughs> it's nice to meet you, Judy. I'm Judy Harrell, H-E-R-R-E-L-L, -L, just like the ice cream. Just like the ice cream. Are you related to the ice cream? I am the ice cream, yes, with Steve. If you had to describe yourself as a flavor of ice cream, what flavor would you be? I'm root beer. Your root beer flavor I'm ice cream? Root beer all the way. <laughs> Tell me why. Well, you can have me in a float, you can have me plain, or you can mix me in. I'm root beer all the way. <laughs> That's awesome. Are you, have you, how long have you been thinking about the answer to this question? I, Steve and I made root beer ice cream. Steve made it actually for me 30 years ago. So this week we have a very special cast to bring you. 